When I first started, it was records. It was records and 8-tracks. I, bu I bought my first cassette deck in Kingston. I never knew anything about cassettes. In the early 90s, of course, uh, they were, it was just CDs. I decided to expand the CDs, but to keep the, the record store as the old-fashioned record store because, number one, CDs are fine, but, I, but a CD store is boring. Yeah, I mean, you buy the CD and you leave. Uh, a record store, you hang out, you talk, you, you know what I mean? It, it's more fun. I've been through a few recessions, and I've noticed stores, when there's a recession, you don't want to spend money. But if you don't have much in the stores, then people, it, there's no choice, then of course people are not going to buy anything. I find people who download and don't buy music, they were the same people who used to tape. So nothing has changed there. I mean, people aren't stupid. If, if something's really good, what they do is they buy the record. So I, I think I'm doing better now with downloading than I, even though you, it, it logically you would think it would be the opposite. I wasn't sure what was going to happen, but of course records have come back with a vengeance. <laughs>